morning. This is uh, a video which I just wanted to um, put on the introduction to my blog and the uh, reason it's starting here with this video is um, this is a reenactment of uh, Beardsley Rummel's famous address to the American Bar Association which appeared in um, the Quarterly American Affairs in January 1946. Um, it is about taxation, about money, about the purpose of taxation, the role of government and corporations, business and business people, people who work in businesses, employees, and how that all uh, pulls together to getting a or the best result, the most efficient result, the most um, happy result for um, organising communities, counties, uh, nations, and uh, so forth. Well, in this. Uh, video at the end I say something along the lines of um, this is a rabbit hole um, it's a rabbit hole of monetary reform uh, there are some very strong views in the subject some are religiously informed some politically informed um, or politically uninformed or religiously uninformed to be more precise um, the internet is a huge, huge body of information. I consider it to be one of the greatest repositories of knowledge um, on a par with uh, Alexander's library or the House of Knowledge in Baghdad. Um, modern ideas, um, something like Project Gothenburg uh, which is a tremendous uh, free to access store of just incredible um, knowledge. So uh, after that, now to talk about my blog, I feel slightly embarrassed. I'm blushing because um, one person's view of the world or one person's uh, uh, wading into the river of knowledge, if you like, uh, is not going to be the same as everybody else's experience and um, how we uh, provide the context of what we read from what we feel we already know uh, is another one of the things which I t look at in my blog, the, the idea of du Duchamp's grey space, which is the... Uh, the idea that the person that looks at the picture makes the picture, well, the, certainly the picture in their own mind, as to what it is they're looking at, um, which is something that uh, um, Duchamp uh, has said that, you know, basically regardo le tableau, um, which is the, the watcher makes the picture. So, um, Anyway, going on to this and talking about this rabbit hole, I mention um, a gentleman called Helmut Kreutz, Kreutz who uh, has written a book called The Money Syndrome, uh, which focuses on the aspects of interest payable on money loaned out. That is uh, usury. And uh, it occurred to me that when someone lands on my blog, um, this this is the screen of uh, people that at the moment there are 33 people reading Taxation for Revenue, which is that um, blog that I just uh, had up on my screen, um, or the video of, 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 of that blog. Um, now you don't get this when you land on the page, what you land on um, is this page here, 
so this is my home page and what I'm going to do uh, instead of this pinned post here which is um, uh, what well, you can read entitled Timonism the Calvinist strain in neoliberal misanthropy uh, I'm going to pin this video there for um, navigating the blog so welcome to the blog if that is indeed where you've come on uh, and found this video and um, the blog has the pinned posts and then it has the latest posts so this is the Beardsley Rummel one and this is one that I uh, did financial literacy the blind leading the blind national debts deficits productivity or austerity and other shibboleths now um, a shibboleth is a widely held uh, incorrect view um, and then it goes down you can press older posts and so it goes on that's the election 2017 debates one I did there's Stephen La Zarlenga who died last month sadly um, democratic fault lines and and so it goes on so you can look at it that way but the thing I wanted to do was just to point out that up here there is a search window so if on that search window I search for Kreutz who I mentioned in that video it should um, come up with some posts where he's mentioned well I know he's mentioned in this post from August 2016 I mentioned Kreutz uh, this is a dialogue I had with Clive Lord um, who was one of the original founders of the Green Par Party uh, my discuss comments thread um, that's just a copy of all the comments in my discuss account um, and he's mentioned in there um, let's see right so there's just those those two that come up that way so then you can click on and uh, off you go there there it is there now on my machine what I can do I can click up here find this is Chrome on uh, the latest version of the Mac OS X operating system uh, that's the part of the machine I'm using at the moment I've got, I can use Windows and also I use Linux a lot on this machine as well but I'm booted into Mac at the moment so if I then put Kreutz up here you can see he's mentioned four times uh, so uh, for the usury full enchilada Kreutz is the babby as they say in Bristol Kreutz has a book now published in English called The Money Syndrome and then there's a link to it there um, and then money is not neutral for Kreutz and neither is it neutral for Steve Keen and countless and growing numbers of heterodox econ economists um, it has also been seen as anything but neutral going back into the midst of time peak ignorance for money was probably around 2007 uh, so it goes on um, but for instance if then I say search up here and one of my interests uh, let's put in uh, Duchamp. Uh, Duchamp. Let's see what comes up then. There we are. Uh, Globalisation, unentangled, conquest of dough, regard a tableau, mean poetry in the making. This is a long poem I wrote, um, or it's not actually finished. Uh, it's about half halfway there but it's a very long poem um, and uh, I wanted to get the concepts down because it's part of a, a trilogy of poems which inform the novel I'm writing at the moment called The Conquest of Doe. Um, on these things there are links in my uh, profile here um, to things like my, my Patreon account hello darling um, and you can visit my Google plus one profile but then also here there's the archive 
so you can look at the archive that's the archive for May and it goes on show more and then visitor map page number of page views this is my Goodreads shelf Goodreads is, is a excellent website uh, has reviews of various books and you can sort of add in the books you want to read books you have read um, so you can click on that and see mine um, etc uh, link to my Facebook page uh, this is the Lulu store which is a link to a collection of my sort of my poems um, here we are, Philosoetry. Um, and so it goes on. So, welcome to the blog. I, that's how you kind of navigate around it. Um, I'm quite pleased with this sort of iteration of, of, of it. Um, it. It works quite well for me. Um, I do have another blog which is kind of like a backup blog which is in WordPress and so I export this blog to WordPress now and again but the WordPress one is really set up to send people back to this one um, because the layout of the other one is um, not as pleasing to my own eye as this one um, such as it is um, and that really is is all I want to say so welcome to the blog and um, please send emails with questions or you know make comments if you wish I don't get much many comments on on the blog it's it's um, it's an interesting kind of meditation for me um, and helps me to uh, pull together some of these different sort of ideas of working out well how do these different areas of life which seems to affect you know, my family's life so much um, and I assume everybody else's and uh, uh, there we have it so welcome to the blog and um, have a great Sunday